In this video, we will be starting your fourth chapter that is basic, basic geometrical ideas of NCERT. In this, we will be studying about the geometrical figures and the lines, points, line segment, rays, curves, all these things. So, in this video, we will be studying about points, lines, rays, line segments. So, first, let's understand about the points. See, when you take a paper and you draw two dots, these are the points A or B. Now you can join these points like this or you can join these points with a straight line or there are two points like this, you can join it like this. So these are the tiny dots through which helps you to make the further figures in the geometry. Now a line segment like I have taken two point A and B and on this point so I am joining these two points so this is your line segment line segment has two end points right now these A and B are known as the A and B are the end points of the line line segment and how do you denote line segment in uh, ge uh, geometry a b and a line over it this is the symbol of symbol of line segment so I, if i take a figure like this I've got three points. Points we have started. Now I'm joining these points. Two points I'm joining. I'm giving it name A, B, and C. So in this, how many line segments we have? We have two line segments. A, B. Line segment B, C as a line segment. Now we are given two points A and B. And I draw a line on it. It is known as the AB is a line segment. But see, when I stretch the line from B and from A and it goes to infinity, then it is known as the, I'm giving it, uh, giving it a name, L. So it is known as L is a line with AB as a line segment. So see what is the property of line? It has no end point. There is no end point of a line where are there are n number of segments on the line that line segment. So in, on this line L AB is a line segment. Now array. See, array has one starting point and no ending point. Let's say it's starting at A. AB is a se uh, segment on the ray and ray is, let's say, A, N. So, A, N is a ray and ray we denote by like this. Line we denote by like this and line segment we denote by like this. So this is a ray. It has one end, sorry, starting point. It has one starting point. If I say sun, sun is giving rays. Right? So all these rays have the starting point from this. And you know these uh, rays of the sun goes to infinite on earth. So this is a ray. If I take a torch and I open the torch, the light coming from the torch is a ray. Right? The starting point is a torch and it goes to infinity and it gives you the light. So these are the rays. Now the intersecting line. See when one line is given AB. 
line is L and the line segment is AB. The other is cutting the line, the other line M is cutting the line L at NO. So this point is known as the point of intersection. And these lines L and M lines are intersecting lines. That at one point they will intersect each other or they will meet each other or cross each other. So any line like this, like this, like this. All these are intersecting lines because one line is intersecting the other line. Now if I say parallel lines, parallel lines are the lines that do not intersect each other at any point or do not coincide each other. Let's say uh, a window, window has a pan on it. So a crossbar on the window has these parallel lines. Now in this, any, no line is coinciding each other in this way line this is this parallel these are parallel to each other right if i say a uh, ruler which helps you to draw the line see line this is a line this is a line this is a line this is a line so l line is parallel to m N line is parallel to O. So N line is parallel to M. N line is parallel to O. If we have to show a parallel lines, we draw like this. The sign like this. That L line is parallel to M line. Right? So these lines are parallel. They do, these lines do not intersect each other. They are just in parallel to each other. Like this starting point and this starting point are same this point and this point is same equidistant from each other so these are the parallel lines i hope you have understood the basics of the geometrical shapes do download our scholars learning app and enjoy the learning experience with us